Hey everyone, I am back, okay? Um, I'm going to finish off the rest of the readings for this week, okay? So if you have Taurus anywhere in your charts, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Mercury, North Node, Midhaven, South Node, these, these readings could be for you. Remember, listen to your discernment to get confirmation at the end of the reading, okay? I am going to shuffle the call on the, on the camera so y'all can know I do shuffle everything, correct myself, blah, blah, blah. Um, I do got some channel messages from y'all, for y'all, okay, out of my, uh, position bar, okay, so it's, it's just something fun and cool to do, okay, and also the, um, the question, the most high position, okay, um, your channel message, Taurus, is balance out the window for your own sake. Now, with this channel message, I feel like some of y'all need to, or this could be for just one motherfucker, um, balance out the window of your soul for your own sake. That's what I got from it. But it might not be for all of y'all Tauruses out there. I swear to God, Taurus, Scorpio, Aries, y'all reading be wild. Hell, even Libras. Okay? But we finna begin, okay? Okay, Holy Spirits. Um... What do the um, Tauruses need to know for this week when it comes to their beliefs? What do the Tauruses need to know when it comes to their beliefs in life, okay? What do they need to know, okay? What do they need to know for their beliefs in life? already know this and reading on um, make me mad but i done already put a protective shield around me and a protective barrier around me so my energy cannot interfere with these damn readings like god damn i don't want my fucking readings to, i don't want people to think that i'm making these damn readings for me like who the fuck do that who the fuck does that i know not me my bad y'all more time. Okay. So far we have the Howard Fence. So something about traditions, um, conceptions in your life, advice in your life, guidance, marriage, organizations, you know. We have the Sister Swords, okay, moving into Karma's Waters. Um, protection, spirit guides, moving forward, and then we got the hangman, okay, so some of y'all could be moving forward to some enlightenment, self-sacrifice self within yourself, like ego deaths, stuff like that, okay, okay, so that's why y'all going to spiritual practitioners or whatever the case may be, okay, the hangman, overall energy, so, Holy Spirit, give me three advice calls for the Tauruses this week, what do they need to know when it comes to their beliefs in life, okay, we got one more, okay, one more please, okay, look at the bottom energy in a minute, we have the seven of swords, the page of cups in reverse, and the five of cups, so, yeah, so, this might not be for all you Tauruses out here, okay? And, like, when I do a Taurus reading, it's always for one motherfucker, okay? So, for you Tauruses out there, um, some of y'all feeling depressed and sad about disappointments in y'all life, okay? Maybe y'all feeling depressed or sad because someone disappointed you. When it comes to love or when it comes to a child in your life or when it comes to something in your life, okay? We got the seven of swords strategizing, okay? Someone is trying to strategize on how to get you, get you out of feeling disappointed or moody with them. Or whatever the case may be, shit, I don't know. Okay, we have the nine of swords worrying, having anxiety, hopelessness. Someone is feeling behind somebody, behind the five of cups back is feeling anxiety about this depression okay if you are depressed right now you are feeling paranoid whatever the case may be 
could be dealing with a Gemini, a Libra, a Taurus, any water signs, okay? What is the Seven of Swords leaving? Okay, the Seven of Swords is leaving something. What are they leaving? Okay, we got the Knights of Cups in reverse. That's what they leaving, okay? We got the Judgments. Um, what, what, how would the Seven of Swords get caught? Or if they getting caught up, what is in front of them? They leaving the Knights of Cups in reverse. So what they about to step they self into or whoever, Seven of Swords, okay? We have the Queen of Swords in reverse, okay? And we also got the Empress, okay? So what's the Queen of Swords in reverse looking at? The Queen of Swords is all about being built to in irrational, just a bitch, okay? What's the Queen of Swords in reverse looking at in reverse? Okay, we have the Six of Wands, okay? So... Yes, yeah, some of you, okay, for whoever is you, or if you are dealing with a Taurus, okay, someone is lead, somebody is, some of y'all in the past, someone could have strategized to make you feel moody about something or make you, dis I'm hearing dissatisfied or make you feel, or somebody did not want to take your offer on something, okay, someone, you probably could have, whoever, could offer something, but someone did not want to do that. Somebody did not want to take that offer, and now you are feeling moody, or the person you try to offer something is feeling moody now. Now they about to walk themselves into being a bitch or being built up about a situation when it comes to some recognition or when it comes to success or when it comes to something in the spotlight, something that comes to good luck, okay? Somebody is being built up now because you... Or, or it's not being built to or being a bitch towards you because you are in a spotlight or whoever is trying to be in the seven of swords energy, they're about to walk themselves into being a built to bitch and being um built or something. I don't know. We have the Empress again, could be your mother figure in your life or someone who's who got the Empress energy or baby mother, baby father, they don't fucking matter, okay? I don't know. Then we got the Queen of Pentacles again, okay? Something when it comes to being grounded, okay? Some of you Tauruses out there, if you don't resonate with this, some of y'all being very grounded, very practical when it comes to your money. What? Why is the Page of Cups in reverse for? Why is it, why is it moody, feeling disappointed? Why someone did not take a, love, a offer of love? Page of Cups in reverse for Taurus, okay? Underneath the Knights of Cups, the Seven of Swords, we have the Knights of Pentacles, okay? Um, someone did not take an offer of love because they feel like it was too slow to come towards them or something. Or someone uh, someone turned down your offer because you took forever to come towards them, okay? We have the Five of Pentacles, okay? Um, you took your time to come towards this person or this person feel a lack of uh, something, okay? What is the Knight of Pentacles looking at for Taurus? Okay, that's too many. What is the Page of Cups in reverse looking at for the Knight of Pentacles? We got the Wheel of Fortune trying to come out. I'm going to do it again. Wheel of Fortune, okay? Someone is slowly and steadily coming in to offer you something when it comes to look or when it comes to your fate. Okay, what is the Knights of Pentacles slowly going towards? Okay. We got the Seven of Pentacles. Someone is slowly going towards protection. Okay. I'm hearing a lot of things. I'm hearing custody battles. I'm hearing um, the protection program. The witness protection or whatever. I don't know. Someone is slowly going towards something to protect themselves from something, okay? Or from someone or somebody. Maybe a kid is wanting to protect themselves or something like that. We have the Wheel of Fortune again, okay? Something regarding good luck or someone trying to protect themselves from something coming out when it comes to a child, okay? We have the sun. It could be about a little boy or a little girl or... The fruit is about to come out, or um, better days in the head of y'all. Y'all be getting good news this week, okay? What's behind the five of cups back when it comes to disappointments? 
is the Five of Cups turning it back on feeling depressed and sad. Five of Cups for Taurus. Okay, so underneath the Knights of Cups in reverse and the Page of Cups in reverse, we have the Nine of Wands. Okay, and the Death card. Okay, putting it for whoever. Okay, someone needs to, in the near future. Someone needs to put an end to feeling paranoid about something. Okay. Make somebody feel like in the near future they going they go they are going to always be depressed. No, you're not. Okay, you need to put an end to this paranoia shit. What's in front of the five of cups when it comes to Taurus? Okay, they're on the love cards. They're on my love cards. Okay, we have the four of cups. Okay, a missed opportunity. You went from the five of cups to the four of cups. Okay, so some of y'all in the near future might get out of the five of cups energy. But you still gonna feel dissatisfied and you still gonna feel like you're missing out on opportunities in your life, okay? We got the death card, put an end to that shit. Then we have the eight of cups walking away, okay? Some of you others, be careful in the near future because some of y'all are thinking or contemplating suicides in the near future or whoever, okay? Whoever this going, whoever going through this, okay? Um, this week you're gonna be feeling like you're gonna be feeling suicidal thoughts. So please don't take action on that shit, okay? Don't take action on that. That's what someone wants you to do. Okay, somebody wants you to have suicidal thoughts. Eight of cups. We have the sun, okay? It's going regarding your child. Maybe your child is having, maybe this week your child will be having suicidal thoughts or someone. Could be your nephew, your little cousin, or someone that you love, like a son, is going to be feeling like this this week, okay? So please protect him, okay? Um, please show him love. You know, you know how to, you know how to do it, okay? Behind the sun is the two of swords and the emperor. Yeah, someone is trying to keep this hidden or keep it blinded. They don't want you to know that they are sending your child these thoughts. Okay, we also have the death card again. Yeah, okay. I just got mad, man. Um, yeah, this is for my. For my son again, Ken, you know what I'm saying? Somebody is sending him thoughts because he looks just like a daddy. So they want him to, I guess they hate seeing him because they would, he would mind whoever so much of their daddy. So they are sending him thoughts, okay? And um, I wish they stop. I really do. I, I pray to God every night they stop this shit. But I'm getting emotional. I really am. I'm getting very emotional. Okay, it could be a Sagittarius that's sending these thoughts, or it could be a Libra, or it could be a Gemini. What's the outcome to this damn reading for Taurus this, this week? Six of Wands, Queen of Swords in reverse, Seven of Swords, and the Knights of Cups in reverse. Okay, so the Seven of Swords, the Knights of Cups in reverse, we got the Four of Swords in reverse. Okay, somebody playing games in this damn reading. Uh, we I got isolation, okay? Somebody needs to isolate themselves from something, okay? So if you are sending little kids suicidal thoughts or just sending my motherfucking kid suicidal thoughts, shake yourself and isolate yourself from this shit because you're pissing me off. You are a bitter ass bitch. Okay, the strength card. But like I said, Ken is going to overcome this regardless. Okay, whoever the Libra, the Sagittarius, it, whoever the fuck you're doing it, just stop. Okay. Behind the strength is the three of pentacles. Yeah, it's two. Could be three individuals walking, or it could be a Sagittarius and a Libra walking with a demonic force or some shit. I'm here and keep your mouth closed, okay? So she um what's the outcome? Page of Cups in reverse, the Knights of Pentacles, and the Seven of Wands. They're on the four of swords in reverse. We got the Howard Fence in reverse. Something is a misconception, or someone is um has a misconception on a situation or the reason why they are sending contemplating re reason why they are sending suicidal thoughts to individuals out here this week or it could be for some you know for kin or whatever the case may be they got a misconception they think they don't understand something okay we got the strength card okay but regardless kin is gonna overcome this whether a motherfucker like it or not okay if i was so they whoever the two other individuals are or the three other individuals are they are being in the five of souls energy. But it's going to go right back to them. Okay? The three of pentacles. Woo! What's the outcome to this reading? Four of cups, five of cups, and the nine of ones. For this week, 
throwing the high fancy and reverse. We got the magician and the ace of one. So yeah. Somebody have a misconception on why they cannot manifest on micro pitches. Okay. So we know how they say you can masturbate to get what she wants in life or whatever the case may be. Yeah. That was someone doing. Someone is uh, masturbating on micro pitches to get what they want. But while they doing it, they Okay, put your own perspective on it. The magician and the ace of wands, okay? Okay, if you don't understand it, then you just don't fucking understand it. But when I tell you to fucking stop, if, it, if the family even tell you to fucking stop, that means fucking stop, okay? Period. Then we got the five of swords. Like, goddamn it, you slow or something? The strength card. Why can't you just manifest to your own goddamn self? Okay, how about that? Masturbate to your damn self. The fuck you mean? You can play with yourself and masturbate what you want. You don't have to think no other motherfucker. Hell, why you fucking yourself, bitch? Say your fucking name. How about that? Look at your fucking pictures. You got the strength card. Whew. Clearing the energy. Okay, this is extra advice for you other Tauruses out here. It's your advice for the other Tauruses out here. I don't know who doing this shit, but this shit is pissing me off. I can never give out good ass fucking reading to you other motherfuckers that got good fucking lives and good fucking energies. Okay, without this bullshit. God damn it. We have the death card, okay? We got guardian, okay? Someone is trying to put an end to someone guardianship, okay? We got balance and we both. Give me three advice cards for this reading for Tauruses. We have something that flipped up with concealment. Okay. Something is concealed. Um, this on the four swords. We got prosperity and reverse. Someone do not want to. Someone do not want to isolate because if they isolate, they won't get prosperity. Okay. This is on the Knights of Cups. In reverse, we got magic, okay? Somebody needs to stop doing it. We got winter in reverse. They're not going to listen. Then we have respect in reverse and secret in reverse, okay? They probably been doing this in winter when Mike was living. We got secret in reverse and respect in reverse. Okay, the secret is already out um, about you masturbating to Michael Pisha, whoever the other motherfuckers is that masturbating to his Pisha. It's already fucking out, okay? And no one respect you. Okay, especially when I done already won, y'all. I know I'm not being jealous. It's just it's just how it is, okay? I'm, I keep telling you motherfuckers, Ken was just like his daddy. Like, I don't understand. Like, when he when Michael got killed, like, all of Michael gifts went to Ken. Okay, so that's why I keep telling y'all, stop doing it. Stop trying to take Ken gifts from him, okay? You are, taking, you are trying to take his gifts. That's why you are not getting prosperity, because you cannot take it. And I do not respect you, period. We are boundaries, initiation, incubation, cleansing, spring, and responsibilities. The family would begin a confirmation on this, okay? What would be healing in this reading for Tauruses? What would be healing in this reading for Tauruses? What would be healing in this reading for Tauruses? Okay, we have healing, okay? Something in this reading will give you healing, okay? Give me three advice calls for healing for a Taurus when it comes to their beliefs. Woo! We got victim consciousness in between. Nike of cups and reverse, page of cups and reverse. Victim consciousness. Someone is playing a victim right now. They feel like they're not doing anything wrong, okay? We got procrastination at home, okay? Somebody is doing this at their home or, some, or someone is a pro- a hiding, okay? Someone do not want to come outside or whatever the case may be. What will be healing is some of you need to uh, stop procrastinating. Some of you others will be healing is your home is going to be fulfilled. You're going to get something back when it comes to your home. We got self-love, take off your mask, beauty, and help from bugs, okay? What do the Tauruses need to do for their self-care? When it comes to their beliefs. 
what they need to do for their self cares. What they need to do for their self cares. Three, please. Okay, we got more than three. This family needs the four swords in reverse, knight of cups, seven of swords. We got massage in reverse, okay? Um, someone needs to go get a fucking massage, okay? We have create art, okay? Somebody needs to go create something or in this reading, someone is trying to manifest, okay? But they don't know how to. We got make an altar. They are dedicated to taking key and gifts or taking anybody fucking gifts, okay? We got make a meal, okay? Because they need some food. Then we got clean your space, okay? Like they hungry and shit. They hungry for prosperity. They hungry for money. They money hungry. And um, we got clean your space, okay? Some, something is negative, okay? This negativity will be cleared away. We got hydrate music. Connect with crystals and build strength. Okay. This is for Tauruses, okay? What would be healing when it comes to Tauruses and their beliefs? I will finna say gifts, okay? What would be the Taurus's beliefs in this reading? Okay, we got healthy choices. Something's gonna be a healthy choice for you when it comes to love, okay? Um, give me three. For um, love for Tauruses. Okay. All these from Knights of Cups in reverse. They all in reverse too. We got clock in reverse. Someone is trying to stop time. Then we have palm trees in reverse because they are feeling broken right now. They don't have no money or something. Or we got healing heart in reverse. Someone do not have a heart. Okay. From the house in reverse. I'm hearing that song by R. Kelly. Turn, turn the hand, turn back the hands of time. We got the butterfly, paradise, dragonfly, and the mask and the golden mirror. Okay. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed this reading. I'm out for this week.